Well, well, well. Look how the turntables. Welcome back to Stick War. This is Stick War 2, Order Empire. It's a browser-based game. I'm literally playing on stickpage.com, and it's free, which I love awesome, fun, free games. I know, right? That's what makes me unique. But in more serious matters, let us continue the campaign. Basically, we've marched our way all the way across... What is this land called again? Inamorta, I guess? I've played Stick War 1, Stick War 2, and Stick War Legacy. Uh, I've been playing Stick War 1 and Stick War 2 over on the other channel, Baron Von Tactics. And I was reading the comments, and you guys are gonna help me beat Medusa here. So let's go ahead and get some miners. Let's go ahead and send our guys to attack. Let's get our guys minerally mining. Um, and then let's go ahead and get some Spiritons. That's gonna be what we want. We want some guys that are gonna be able to tank some damage. Let's go ahead and drop some fireballs on these guys. And then pull back maybe a little bit, because we gotta deal with this giant. Our giant throws rocks. Their giant has a giant club. They've also got a necromancer, and I don't like him. I don't like him at all. Uh-oh. Let's pull our Merrick back. I kinda wanna pull my wizard back as well. Archer's sacrificial. He, he, he can, he can die. You may die. Miner, look at this. But yeah, you guys were telling me basically like how to do a little bit better on the controls here, and it's amazing what you can do when you have a little bit better command of the controls. Wizard! Run! Fly, you fool! What are you doing? Oh, he was doing the kill animation. I thought he was dying. So since they're poison, I'm sending him back. You, sir, need to go out and fight. Let's get two more miners. Um, but basically we're gonna try to continue being on the attack here. No! Wizard! I sent the arrows in- oh god. Wizard boy's not gonna make it, I don't think. He's gonna- Don't- Don't kill him! Don't- Don't die! Gandalf! Where's Gandalf? Gandalf's dead. Why? I apparently killed him. So we're at the mineral line already here. And look at this. This is going pretty well, I think. Should we send- you know what, giant? Go ahead and go back home. Sir. Yes, there we go. I'm gonna leave these guys here to attack the cobra. Of Shelob? No, just kidding. This is not the Spider Queen. Although it'd be kind of cool if we did that. Yeah. Oh wow. Let's let's deal with the bad guys here, guys. All right. So we've got a decent amount of money. I know. I know. I'm I'm a little bit rusty. We haven't played in a while. And I, you know what? I'm gonna just start stacking up those guys. Sword rats are garbage. What you say? So basically, you tank with the Spiritons and use your Archidens. Spiritons are like your Spartan hoplites here, and Archidens are your archers. And, uh, maybe if we're lucky, our archers will blot out the sun. Let's go ahead and, uh, upgrade- Ooh, see, he's healing up, and I like that. I guess we can go ahead and send him out. He's been healed, we're gonna want that. We've got these two guys not doing anything because, you know, maybe not the best commander. Oh! Medusa! What is happening to my army? She just- Oh, she turned everybody to stone! Oh, okay, I got a- I got a second army, though. Well, that's terrifying. Oh my god. What is she doing? Everybody attack. You guys, mine. You guys do that thing. Did she just... Okay, so we're literally having to fight Medusa here. Do I have a wizard or is the wizard taken out? No, the wizard's up there. Let's go ahead and call some of this down. This is amazing! So this is the boss fight. I feel like this is like a demi-boss. Like, not a main boss, you know? Oh my gosh. Her siren's call that's turning my men to stone is pretty incredible, though. Look at that! All of my... Spiritans... What are you doing there, wizard boy? Gandalf, get vengeance! Okay. Uh, is anybody poisoned? Did we just win? We just won the game. We just beat... Stick War 2. <laughs> that's incredible! Now we're playing Stick Empires. Look at our armory! So, I need to unlock this, but I've got no gold to do it. Let's play a match. Select my empire. No freaking way. I've never been the elementals, so we're gonna do that. Elemental versus elemental. Okay. In the swamplands. It says it's even, but... Oh god, I've got spider crabs. Where are my soldiers? Oh, here they are. Oh my god, I'm gonna be so bad at this. Charfrog. Heavily armored infantry. Scorch. A powerful caster. Treacher. Where's my guys that do the mineral thingies? What are these called? Oh god, I think I'm gonna die. Fire elemental. Air elemental. Water elemental. Earth elemental. Let's get an earth elemental. Seems like the right thing to do at the time. Now what's my enemy- Oh, there's a fog of war. Of course. Hello! Elemental! Attack! 
Let's send him out there, see what's going on in the middle grounds here. Uh, he's got a funny looking head. You know what, actually? No. You know what? No. Let's attack this guy's crab turtles. I'm gonna go get them, man. I don't know. That's their statue. So this is interesting. Oh, look, he's got one, too. So... And he's got another guy. So we'll pull our guy back, maybe? I have no idea. I should have picked a, an empire that I knew of. Where's my miners? Oh, they're still- they're doing their mining things. Do I only get two? Ooh! Converts a unit into a miner! That may not have been the best idea. Did they just evaporate each other? I'm- I'm really at a loss as to what exactly is happening. Let's get a fire elemental out here. So I can morph one of my guys- Okay, so this is probably like... When you're playing StarCraft for the first time, you're like, Oh, I understand Terran, it all makes sense. And then, like, literally... What are they doing? Are they converting him into their guy? I really have not a clue what's going on, but I'm, I'm kind of digging it. We'll get another Earth Elemental out here. Hey! Get away from my crab people! Well, needless to say, this isn't going well, but I got a Fire Elemental now, and he can, he can Super Mario this, which is kind of cool. So he's shooting his fireballs. <laughs> Alright, let's pull the miner over there, so... Nope, they froze him. Of course they did. So the Elemental Empire is really strange. I think there's a lot of advanced mechanics here, and it's probably not the best one to start out with. Oh, this is pretty cool. Look at this. This guy's got mine carts, and they call them mine carts. Dude, I wish there were dwarves. Ooh, he's got golden archiduns. Basically, I'm spectating a battle between Orzurzma and Natakrev. Now, he's sending out... The little what? The little, little ninja cat guy. So it's ninja cat versus Archidon. Oh, he's running! This is pretty fascinating that I can, like, spectate the battles. It's interesting. I wonder how good is, like, the, the gold one. Oh, he's got a, he's got a sword wrath. This guy's got a lot of upgraded dudes. The other guy does not have so much. The camera's a little wonky. Am I watching their viewpoint, or am I able to take control of my own? All right, so this time I'm gonna go with the Chaos Empire. Yes! Okay, so it's Chaos versus, um, Order, which I'm pretty excited about. Let's just go ahead and get, well, oh, a crawler? Or a bomber? Hmm, a dead. An eclipse or I don't know, man. This is crazy. I wish there was a campaign where you could, like, learn the mechanics of the different empires. But unfortunately, there's not, so we're gonna have to just kind of like, guess about it. Crawlers and Juggernauts. Well, I know what a Juggernaut is. They're pretty much like, um, they're very similar to, uh, Spiritans, I believe. And they cost the same as well. Let's get you on, uh, mana at this point. Now, I'm saving up because I do want a Juggernaut. I don't know what he's doing. I have no idea. We don't have any control of that. A Marokai, I believe, is the, uh, Raises the Dead, maybe? Not enough mana to construct that unit! Sons of guns! Let's get some crawlers out here. And another enslaved miner. So this is kind of fun. I'm literally just going out here, I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm having fun with it. So, that's basically, that's unfortunate. That we kind of were wasting our money right there, the opportunity cost. Alright, let's send our little, our little kitty cat. Oh, look at that. Look who took the middle ground. Oh! Well, I see what you're up to. He's planning a rush, but I'm gonna take the middle ground here. And I'm gonna use my scout cats to hold the grounds. All right, he's got a lot of, oh God, that's scary. I have no army, by the way. Uh, what do we want, what do we want? A zombie that uses, oh my gosh, I hated these things. I hated them because they could poison me. He's got a miner, he's, and I don't know if he, is lagging, he's gonna forfeit. No! I, yeah, we need more guys on getting mana. That's the issue here. Yeah, he's doing basically like the campaign style. Let's get a big, big army. Alright, so I'm gonna go Juggernauts and a few kitty cats and then some zombie poisoners. If he doesn't have Merricks, he's, his guys are gonna get poisoned. I always hate it when that happened to me. A bomber uses, oh. Let's get some of these out there. And I'm gonna, hold on. The Juggernaut's almost done. If I send a few bombers in right now, yeah, we're doing that. Oh my gosh, we're gonna make a lot of those guys. Alright, now do I have any new miners that I can send? Oh, right, there's my Juggernaut. I'm, j I'm basically gonna go boom boom time on his army. It's gonna be great. Alright, we got the third one on its way. 
Uh-oh, here they come. There goes his archers. Yeah! Wait, his archers are still alive? They survived that? Oh god, I thought we had this. Doesn't look like we do, guys. We got another Juggernaut out here. We got the Poisoner. Oh, but he's not poisoning, probably, because I probably have to go back. Let's see, do I want a Deaden or an Eclipse or a Winged Flying Archer? Or a Giant? Or we could get a Marokai. Hey, that's actually working. Go out and get him, boys. I think we won that one, actually. Yeah. We definitely won that one. I'm surprised. I guess that's the thing about RTS games, you know? Go get him, kitties. Now, let's get a dead. A zombie that uses a piece of its own. Yeah, as projectiles, we want a little bit more of that. And then... I'm gonna get a Marokai. We can afford it. So how's our army doing over here? We're in the mineral line. Oh, yeah. We've got this one. He, he doesn't have any archers. My Juggernaut is still alive. Oh, he's still alive by a lot. I didn't see his health bar for a moment, so I thought he was almost dead. Run! Let's let's attack. I'm gonna target his uh with my range, guys. Alright, when we're gonna now let's just start spamming crawlers, maybe. Basically what I'm doing is targeting his miners. Hehehe! <laughs> so this is my second online battle. The first one I think I would have handily lost. I think that's pretty safe to say. Oh! We won! You gotta be kidding me! Yeah! Alright, so we tried the Chaos Army. I didn't really get to experience. You've been awarded 10 Empire Points for your first win of the day. Now, why are they Empire Points if I played Chaos? You know what I mean? But look at this. So there's three factions. The, uh, I guess the classic. Then you've got Chaos. you got the Order, the Battle Army of Order, Army of Chaos, and the Elementals. And I really wish there were campaigns for the other factions as well, because I really, really enjoy them. And it'll be fun to learn their different mechanics as well. Okay. I'm gonna go with order, because I know how they play, right? And order versus order, we're gonna be on the swamplands. I'm gonna go immediately there, and I'll get one sword wrath. Just to kind of like get the middle early, and or maybe not early, maybe I'll be late, who knows? Maybe the guy's already there, and he's got a fully operational battle station. But I don't know. I don't know that. There's a fog of war. You! Go get it. Go explore it. Why, I make sure all my guys are mining. You're about to, like, head there and not mine. I'm gonna need another guy. Okay. So we got the middle ground. I can see. It looks like... Excuse me. Are you not using that, man? I think we got it, guys. I think we got this one. So what I'm gonna do is start getting some guys on mana. And I'm gonna be keeping an eye. There's probably a shortcut button to go to your base and back, but I'm using the, um left arrow keys, you know, left and right arrow keys, not just one or the other, but both of them. Get another Sword Wrath out there, just in case. I mean, I could probably rush his line with Sword Wrath right now, but I, I, I just, I'm not feeling inclined to do that. There's only 130 people still online playing this game. There we go, there's my other Sword Wrath. So, here we go. I'm gonna get some Spiritons up now. I'm gonna get some Spiritons. We're gonna get the old Shield Wall. Okay, so he's got one Archer on and one uh, sword Wrath. Get an archer done when we can afford it, which is now. Then we should probably get back to focusing on our economy. Yeah, he's got what? Two Spiritons. Or excuse me, two Sword Wrath, one archer done right now. We get to see his army basically by holding the middle ground. It's it's pretty advantageous to us right now. Oh. Aha! You'll never take me alive! Never! <laughs> oh, the arrow to the head. Whoa, 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 what are you doing out there? That's not good. Do you think he's got us? He took the middle. Uh, let's see. With these guys, this guy will tank the damage. I bet you I've got a stronger economy than him. So then, I'm not doing myself any favors, but I, I really want both the Sword Wrath here before I attack. Because I think we'll be able to take them. My Spiritan should be able to tank most of that. Alright, so the Sword Wrath is coming. About now. Let's get another Spiritan on the way. And we'll go out and fight. I'll rush one of the, uh, Sword Wrath back there to start hitting his Archidens. There we go. See, look. Tanked all of it. And we should have a Spear Tin coming out now, so we'll send him into the attack. Come on. If I can... Yes, the kill animation is awesome. If he can survive... Okay, well, never mind. We got two of them now, so... Yeah, basically, now I'm interested in getting to the back line. He's sending out some cheap sword guys, as well as some archers. I'm gonna target his miners with one of these guys. I'm by no means like a veteran, like uh, an expert or a veteran. It just seems like it's just basic, like what strategy principles, right? 
targeting his mineral line, then he's not going to be able to bring in more reinforcements. And I think, I wonder if this is the same guy and we keep playing each other because we're similar, like, experience, you know? But he doesn't know. I've been playing the campaign quite a bit. So that was a pretty fun battle, but you can see where it turned for, uh, like, I'm green in blue. Here's my economy. His economy, my economy wasn't that great. It was a little bit better. My army was maybe a little bit stronger, but that just goes to show you the tanking ability of the Spiritans. So, yeah. Now, what can we do? See, I got E of 10, so I can't unlock this. What does this even do? Today we summon a unit. I wonder if it's just a visual representation or if it's an actual thing, right? Because I know in Stick War Legacy they have an effect on things. Maybe it's just like cosmetic. It's like, oh, that's cool. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching another episode of Stick War 2. This one, we beat Medusa finally. I'm gonna have some more videos up on it over on Baron Von Tactics if you wanna check out more. I'm gonna try to do just a complete run through of the campaign. So make sure to check that out, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!